A Maple Grove officer continues to recover after he was dragged during a traffic stop in November. The suspect was charged, but the union representing the police say the charges don't go far enough. The incident happened at midnight on November 13th. The criminal complaint says officers pulled over 40-year-old Daniel Rudolph on Weaver Lake Road and 83rd Way for having tinted windows and failing to signal. Officers learned that Rudolph had a suspended license and saw an open container of alcohol inside his Ford Escape. Police had Rudolph exit the vehicle to perform a field sobriety test, but Rudolph ran back to his car and tried to drive away. Officer Brandon Gross grabbed onto Rudolph, at which point Rudolph allegedly pinned the officer's arm inside the vehicle and dragged him. After being dragged 40 yards, Officer Gross freed himself as the vehicle sped away. Rudolph, however, was captured the next day. And the Hennepin County Attorney's Office charged him with obstructing the legal process and fleeing a peace officer. Both are felonies. He faces a maximum sentence of eight years if convicted on both counts. However, the Minnesota Police and Peace Officers Association wanted Rudolph charged with assault. In a release today, the union said this charging decision represents an alarming trend from the Hennepin County Attorney's Office where violent offenders are not being charged or undercharged with crimes. Officer Gross, meanwhile, has since returned to work, but the union says he has lingering pain and swollen, inflamed ligaments in his shoulder from being dragged. We have requested a statement from the Hennepin County Attorney's Office. Find more local news stories at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.